morning everyone. I'm just going to do um, the Milan demo today, so let's just pull it in. Um, so I'm guessing if you're here you're not completely new to Bambini and you can go on over and check out a little bit more about who we are and what we do on our other person videos. So today I'm just going to do a very quick demo of um, the Milan pram, the modern style pram we have here. Um, so at the moment I've got the bassinet on, so this is how you're seeing it at the moment, and then um, there is also a toddler seat attachment. In terms of colours, this is the blue fabric one with the cream and tan ink leather panels. We do also do a black version, so you can check out the pictures of that on our site website as well. Um, and then uh, just so you know what comes in the box when your Milan arrives, um, I've already mentioned the bassinet and toddler seat, but we do include all accessories as well. So that's the baby bag cup holder, rain cover, inset neck, foot covers and the winter fabrics. So yeah, everything's there, there's no um, hidden costs. So let's look at some of the features on the bassinet. I've got the foot cover on the bassinet at the minute, so it covers your baby. Um, and then if you want a bit more protection, I've got this extra flap of um, fabric on here. You can actually attach it to the hood there, just to um, create a nice dark shady little room in there. Um, so the foot cover, Pop the buttons either side, that's how it attaches and how you remove it, so it's very easy. Um, a few features on the hood, uh, the carry handle for the bassinet is up here on the hood, so you just open that zip and you can carry the bassinet from there. On the back here is an air vent panel, so it's again a zip opening. Um, once you've got that opened, you can pull down the fabric cover and then you've got a mesh panel, so you've got air ventilation through the bassinet. Um, and the mesh still provides that UV protection for your baby. Um, if you don't want the hood up, just you can collapse it down all the way out the way. So just literally pop a button either side, uh, sorry, button on the hinge point either side that you press in, and then that drops down completely out the way. Um, so inside is all natural fibres. It's cotton and coconut fibre. Nice wide padded bassinet there. This lining is removable, so you can wash it. You can put it into a machine wash. So it's just a zip there to remove. Um, and then a unique feature is the sit-up support in the back here, so you can sit your baby up, um, interact with them as they're getting a little older. Um, and also it's a great feature to um, enable you to elevate your baby's head if they have reflux. So a great feature there. Um, so to put the hood back up, just simply pull it up and click it into place like that. To remove the bassinet, it's just a squeeze lever either side like that. So that's now released. I'm just going to pick it up using the carry handle I mentioned earlier. It's just an easier way to pick it up off the chassis. So a few more features on this bassinet. It's got a solid base for extra safety for your baby. Um, and then the bottom is rimmed with uh, plastic. So it doesn't matter what surface you're putting it down on, you won't ruin any of the exterior fabrics. And then the shape is curved, so it can double up as a cradle. Um, you can actually pop it down on the floor and rock your baby in it like that. Um, so yeah, you don't always just need the wheels with you to enable you to rock your baby. You can just, there you go, do that and then carry like this. So that's the bassinet down. I'll pop that to one side. Let's pull the chasse back in. So I did mention the baby bags included, so that's a great inclusion. Send you getting another one and it does integrate to the frame so it's easily accessible for you just here. Um, the height of the handlebar is adjustable so it's just a hinge point there so you can adjust that height. The handlebar is finished in a black eco leather and this leather is breathable so it's more hygienic you won't be getting sticky sweaty hands. Uh, the frame is aluminium powder coated in a matte black and to save scratches, this is our modern style frame, so it's got the swivel wheel features and um, compact fold. Um, you can lock the swivel wheels so they align to the chassis if you prefer. So I've just twisted the cap on the top there. Now those wheels are locked into alignment with the chassis. We do recommend you do lock them prior to folding as well, if you have a minute to think of that. Um, so purchase basket on this pram in the standard position. Um, and Amberland is unique in that it does have a cover to the purchase basket so you can pull that back out of the way if you don't want it but it does mean if you put any valuables like your keys or your phone in there you can zip it closed and you know it's safe and you won't be losing anything. Um, now a unique feature for the Milan, uh, one thing we're all about here at Bambini is a sprung pram experience so that's like the nice bouncy sprung pram that you can rock your baby in so um, if you can just see past Milan to the York, the traditional York here has got that experience. And we've also brought that out in a unique um, system on the back axle here, so you can actually rock your baby on this. 
and that also doubles as the best all-round suspension as well. Um, finally on tyres, puncture proof gel, all four tyres are puncture proof gel, so nice and soft, easy um, to care for, maintenance free, they won't be needing um, blowing up or you don't need to look after or source out any punctures. So let's fold the frame down. So very easy, it's just a lever either side you're pulling up towards you and then there's one hinge point, so literally it folds down in half. So there you go, a lever either side, I've just pulled towards me, it's now released. And it will want to fold, it will want to go down now into a fold, it will lock in. Um, so that's it folded. If you want a more compact fold, you can then drop this handbar in. So to pick it up now, you can use the front and back axle, or like I'm going to do here, either side. I mean, it's a lightweight chassis and it weighs about six and a half kilos. So to put it up again, very easy, just release this storage catch just here and pull it up until you hear it click. Um, and I'm just going to adjust the handlebar to my position um, and that's it back up and ready to go. Now let's get the toddler seat in. So I just grab that here, it's already made up. Okay. So the toddler seat can go on in either direction. So um, we can pop it on in a world facing mode, so where your baby's facing outwards or like I will do here in the parent facing mode. And this is the same way that you would attach the bassinet. So you're just dropping it into the housing. So you switch to the toddler seat when your baby can sit up unaided. Um, and that's normally, it will depend on your baby. It's normally about six to nine month mark. Um, once they're in this seat, it will take you all the way through. It's been safety tested 20 kilos, which is the average weight of a five year old. So you can see it's, it's fine to use. So a couple of free accessories with um, this toddler seat. Firstly, the winter fabric or foot cover I'm holding here. It wraps around the footrest, pop a button either side, so you can see it just makes that nice and warm and snug for your baby there on a cold day. Um, the other accessory, great one because it helps you keep the toddler seat clean, is this insert, seat insert here. So extra comfort, but it's removable and you can pop it into a machine wash. It's cotton and coconut fibre, the same as the inside of the bassinet. So let's look at some other features on the toddler seat. It's got an adjustable hood, so you can fold it right in, right out, generous shade, because you're wanting that shade, of course. On the back is an air vent panel just here, um, and it also means if the seat is on in the other direction, you can look through, it's a peekaboo window, you can see what Bub's doing in there. On the seat back is the handle that when you raise, it gives you your seat recline. So one, two, few resting positions all the way back to a full life lap recline. So um, now we've got that reclined, we've still got the head barrier created just here. If you still want full shade from your hood, even though the seat is reclined, just open this zip panel. So now we've got a whole new section of fabric opened here, so you've got full shade even though the seat's reclined. Let me just show you a couple more things on the seat recline, just so you can see it's a life, complete life lap, hopefully it looks um, there'll be some angles from the exterior, but on the inside it's a complete life flat, so so much more comfortable for your baby. Some seat reclines, some um, on the market, some um, seat brands on the market, they actually just pivot like that. So although uh, your baby's lying back, the legs have gone up in the air, it's a bucketed seat. Um, and of course, if your baby prefers to sleep on our side or tummy, they would not be able to do that. Whereas this life flat design, um, no problem at all. To put the seat up, just simply push at the back, and it will go up and lock into the position. Um, so let's just swivel it around again. You see me adjust the adjustable footrest. It's finished in black eco leather. By now your baby will be wearing shoes and walking a bit, so that um, saves any visible dirt. Uh, you've also got this um, belly bar, bumper bar, um, just here. So um, it's removable or hingeable, but if you leave it in place, it does actually create that extra level of safety. It means you're child is completely surrounded with the structure of the seat. Um, and then on safety, we've got the safety harness, a five point brake design that is required um, here in Australia. Um, so it's the safest design of harness anywhere in the world because um, there's no um, strangulation hazard. There's no big loops of strapping at all. So yeah, this is the design that we use on both our toddler seats. So yeah, that's the Milan show to you. Please jump on to our website now and make sure you register. A great reason to do that is 
any uh, discount codes coming through, we release them to our email subscribers first. So our website is bambiniprams.com.au. Um, any other comments or questions, just get in touch and um, one of our team will get back to you. So that's it for today. If you wanted to see a York demo, that will be tomorrow. Um, but thank you very much for joining, whether live or replay. Um, and yeah, we will speak again another day. Thank you.